welcome to Bosnia. More specifically, the town of Mostar. And that right there is the Mostar Bridge. Originally built by the Ottoman Empire in the 1500s, it was sadly destroyed by Croatian armed forces in 1993 during their war with Bosnia. Fortunately, after the war, it was reconstructed from 2001 to 2004, and now stands again in all its majestic beauty. When I arrived, I noticed a guy asking for tips if they wanted to see him jump off the bridge, which he then proceeded to do. This man was a member of the Mostar Diving Club, and while the club wasn't established until 1995, jumping off the bridge has been a local tradition for the past 450 years. And according to Bosnian legend, a man is not worthy of a girlfriend until he has done it. Not wanting to end up an incel, I was relieved to find out I could join the diving club too. If you make a jump off the bridge, you came here, you signed up in the book, and you take the certificate. But at 95 feet high, the bridge was way taller than anything I had jumped off previously. 80% of them are from Australia and New Zealand because they used to jump from cliffs from they're, they're crazy, for they're crazy <laughs> motherfuckers. Yeah. Yeah. They're insane. Uh, but I'm a little insane myself. Alright, fuck it. It's too tempting. I'm going hippo mode with the hippos. So we're still game to give it a go. The diving club doesn't let anyone just show up and jump though. So you need to go to the 10 meter jumping platform. First, you have to train on a platform half as high as the bridge till they deem your form acceptable. If you are not good in your style, we'll show you our style. If you are good in your style, at least what we can do is to fix your entrance. Yes. Because that's the most important that's thing. That's the most important. Because if you hit the water at a bad angle, it's not going to be pretty. So all of these three and a half thousand people. They are safe, they are alive, of course, they got surf case. Are there some people, though, who didn't make the book because they didn't survive of, the jump? Of, no, uh, they didn't occur as the practice. Despite what he told me, I later found out that four people have died since 2012, along with countless serious injuries. But figured there was no harm in training and then deciding whether or not I jumped. Don't be upset because if you don't make a jump with the bridge, how old are you? 34. 34. You are young, you have time. Yeah. You jump from some cliffs, practice, practice, come next year after two years. If you will be not good. If you are good, you are allowed to jump. Okay. After that, you signed up in the book, you take certificate, and you pay a membership first time in your life and never again. 10 euros for practice. Yeah, I think so. 10 one, euros for practice? For practice. Okay. 25 euros to jump over the bridge. So Should I wear shoes? No, no, without shoes. And you are jumping? No, without shoes. shoes. Okay, I feel like I might want So, to. you can try practice. My cameraman decided to join me in this dumb endeavor, which I guess was mildly comforting. That looks good. What do you think? How was it? Uh, is he gonna... It's good, but not really, maybe, for the bridge. That's, that's, that's from I passed my training with flying colors. And now it was time to prepare for the moment of truth. If I don't survive this jump, I want it on record that I was inspired by Aquaman Dan. So, my blood will be on his hands. As you might be aware, I don't have the best track record when it comes to stunts. And the last two times I tried doing some shit like this with my daredevil friend Aquaman Dan, we're both near-death experiences. Dude, am I gonna clear the rope? Yeah. Let's get naughty! <laughs> <laughs> Almost splitting my head open on a rock. I didn't really clear that rock very much! And nearly breaking my neck falling out of a tree. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. But the Balkans have been kind to me so far, so I held out hope that this time, I would finally stick the landing. I think I got this, though. I know I got this. Especially seeing I'd be zeroed in on success thanks to Roman Focus, a dietary supplement created by doctors with ingredients that support calm energy, mental acuity, and concentration. All things I'd need with my life literally on the line. These things are great. It's a nice little buzz without the caffeine jitters, even though there is caffeine in it, but for some reason they got some other stuff that just balances it out 
and uh, you don't get the jitters at all. Go to GetRoman.com slash Donnie for $15 off your first order. That's GetRoman.com slash Donnie for $15 off your first order of Roman Focus. Now back to the jump. Straight and strong when you go to the river. Yes, yes. Your fly, no important how you fly if you are not important. And you can use your arms, right? Yes, yes. that's balance. your wings. Thank you. If you yes. go forward, you can do more. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Yeah. With your legs, it, heads. It's so yeah. Old, yeah. Yeah. And before one, two meter, your head down. Yeah. Yes, yes. Only yeah. 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 the important Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want red suit, he can give you that. Oh, no, it's okay. That will protect you. Yeah. Oh, I uh, yeah. Thankfully, my cameraman offered to go first, so I'd still have a chance to back out if he didn't make it. All right, Alex. You have any last words? Wish me luck. All right. Yeah. Let's go, man. Good luck, bro. You got this. You're a better jumper than me. I couldn't hear him complaining about his leg from up on the bridge, and he looked okay to me. So I started to get in position to take the leap of faith myself. There you go, man. Alright, one, two, three. How was it? It's not really good, a little bit on the side. But he looks like he is okay. I had survived, which was really the best outcome I could have asked for. You're alive! Yeah, I got rocked. I'm fine though. I might have a little bruise. And now was a member of the Mostar Diving Club for life. And if you want to jump again, just show the number and then find you in here. In this. The 3,475th person to jump. Well, I did it. I was told my form wasn't too good. Maybe I have a slightly bruised buttocks. My camera guy, on the other hand, had perfect form. He made like zero splash. His knee bent in a weird way, and he's a little concerned about that. Hopefully no ligament damage. When I hit the water, I felt my knee twist, and it was super uncomfortable and super painful. I could barely walk. I was hobbling out of the water. I ended up going to get it looked at while we were in Bosnia, and I didn't get an x-ray or anything because I didn't think that would even show anything. But I did end up going to get it checked out when I was back home in New York. I got um, an x-ray which showed that there was a slight crack in part of my knee. And I just got this voice message, so I'm gonna share it with you guys. Hey Alex, uh, I was just returning a message I had about you on your MRI results. You do have a non-displaced fracture of the lateral rim of your lateral tibial plateau. There's like a, a crack in the bone. We're gonna persevere, you know? I'll give him a couple Roman focus. We'll get through it. You do need to restrict your activity. I mean, I may have a camera guy that, that can't walk for the rest of the trip, but that's okay. We only got like four days left. We don't want you engaging in a high impact activity to your knee, like jumping, running, um, jumping from a bridge from 80 feet into water. Those things would all be very bad and could possibly worsen that fracture and make it progress into something worse. He can do all the stationary shots and then I just can rove around with this camera. What I think happened is that the water was just so still that there was so much water tension that I happened to hit it in such a perfect way that it, it caused that. As you guys can see when Donnie hit, his side hit and he, he probably got bruised or whatever, but it's just it's just funny that I had a cleaner cleaner drop. I got way more injured and, and Donnie, Donnie took, took it like a champ. Finally got the redemption I was looking for. Cheers. <laughs>